People like games. What up, people? It's Solo, and welcome to the story of Magic the Gathering, the card scared. game that I'm sure everybody is familiar with, but very few people know how to play. It was created by a guy named Richard Garfield, who became a big fan of playing cards and marbles in his youth when he was being moved around to different countries and learned it was a perfect way to communicate with other kids without necessarily speaking the language, which then sort of inspired him uh, until he came back to the States uh, and heard about Dungeons and Dragons. Because he couldn't get his hands on a copy of it, he ended up actually making it his own, which was a bit more like Clue because he figured the game was finite and had an ending, only to learn when he actually did get a copy of Dungeons and Dragons that actually, no, this game is just never ending. And so there's no real start point or there's no end point to it. And that caught him by surprise and inspired him to want to create uh, something similar, but that could be a bit more self-contained. That ended up now future fast forward to young Richard Garfield as a graduate student at UPenn in mathematics, where he was working on this game called Robo Rally, which got him introduced to a guy named Peter Atkinson, who is the CEO and founder of Wizards of the Coast, which funny enough owns Dungeons and Dragons now, that's how that goes, uh, who saw the game Robo Rally and was like, yo, this is super dope, but I don't have the money to produce that. So why don't you try to like make a card game or something that would be like easily playable at conventions during downtime. Then Garfield went back, had an inspiration for five different colors of magic and different type of characters and deck building. He came back, told uh, Atkinson, Atkinson was like, yo, this is going to be a million dollar idea, which he actually put on an old forum board. Then they hired some artists, put it together, and it debuted in 1993 in Fort Worth, Texas, and uh, just landed and people loved it. And since then it has grown and become where it is. Um, and that's about it. Don't have too much more to add to that, but I'm already over, so I'll be back. Peace.